All right, old T versus Wadi here. Okay, so this is loser semis. Gonna be a best of five here. Let's see uh, if Wadi can get the run back here over a T this time. One of the harder people to go against, honestly. He's just not only is uh, Pac-Man really uncommon character and unconventional, mm -hmm. it's just going against like the best Pac-Man to do it right now is just very difficult. Right now, why are you doing a really good job of winning these projectiles? Completely oh. down it. I was gonna say. Yeah. Yeah, he looks like he's uh, comfortable edge guarding Pac-Man for the most part. Nice parry, and he's in with a forward tilt for oh. safety, but he almost gets the whiff punish here on Wadi's landing. Oh man, that was almost a really good gyro setup for Wadi. Oh, missed the grab. Nice. Great use of Still up right there. Now. Oh, I like the kick. Kicks the gyro away before he gets edge guarded. Oh my god, free punish here, but no smash attack, surprisingly enough. Oh, very nice. Oh, okay. And he actually knows the timing for the match, too, so Wadi demonstrates that. Yeah, I've seen... How to properly use it. Yeah, I've seen Wadi get a bunch of different followers from the downer, actually. Like, I've seen him wait out where they uh, they go from their... Uh, their when they get released from the grab, and I've seen him get up smashes from that as well. I don't know, he's just really patient when it comes to that. Mm -hmm. But uh, T, even up the stocks pretty evenly. Not falling too far behind you. But here comes Wadi. Oh man, if there's anyone who's gonna know how to use the gyro, it's a Pac-Man player. Right now though, these aggressive options from the ledge getting beat out by these nares from, from Wadi here. And he's gonna hang back, he sees that he's trying to get set up here with the hydrant. Oh, oh my goodness, key into the hydrant, that's so much percent. Nice, because he's a forward tilt. I like <laughs> I like how I was going for dash attack. Trying to see how Wadi was going to land after forward tilt. Uh, Great shield, but oh, he gets yeah. the forward smash too. He's got to watch the bell here. Oh, wow. What a setup too, because you know how the bell has a bounce to it, especially at the ledge. Yep. That gives T enough time to go for a kill option like down air. Especially those high percents. Trampoline to survive, oh, nice. but the down air to yeah. stall him out. Yeah, he thought he could get the spike there, but there's the up air, man. No take, no percent taken whatsoever. Why are you keeping this super close? Nice. Mm -hmm. Oh no, this Galaga setup, so much percent. Nice, that was fire hydrant even for a stall. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> That down so so good. Oh. Nope. Not going to be it just yet. And T able to recover. Far tilt. Can you read the recovery? Oh. Yep. Four so smash. close. Nah, just it. So close. There's the bell. What is he going to do with it, though? Oh. Okay. Really good for why you recognize that. That was actually really close. If you got hit by that, definitely was uh, in danger of dying. Watch the gyro. Oh. Oh. Oh my goodness, Wadi stalling so extraly off st Oh, why? Unfortunately, man, stalling was Why did he air dodge? Oh, no, he, he wanted to air dodge up because he didn't have uh, gas. Yeah, I was going to say, that's probably what he wanted to do. Oh, no. But that's what stalling costs you, too, man. You stall that long, it'll, it'll definitely cost you that kind of price. And you have to ask yourself, are you willing to pay it every time? Dang. It was actually so good recovery, too, because he avoided the hydrant and everything. T just barely going to take that first game. Uh, I'm definitely impressed with how wide he's playing this matchup, though, for sure. Yeah. Okay, running back to PS2. Nice, up to up air. Wadi well, starts off with a great lead here, 41%. Yeah, Wadi well, was uh, doing a good job of holding his lead uh, in the previous game as well. Oh my goodness. Gallagher is just so much percent, man. Up throw, nice. Looking for the up air. Mm 
Yeah, T's always looking for people to just like get baited out by his movement, and he's mm -hmm. getting caught by like the F smash. Oh. oh. Hey, last part of the back air, keeping him off the stage. It's a follow up here. Oh, no. still gets the up air out. This is the up tilt, but I like the fact that Wadi knows what to go for next. Oh no, the water pushed away his gyro. Oh, nice. My dodge, back throw. That won't take the kill yet here, but it gives T from time for the setup. Okay, this time he's able to get the ledge. It's kind of a similar situation to how we lost last time. They forced off stage for a very long time. But here you go. Potential edge guard here. He has to go low. Oh, I like it. good angle on the side B to avoid the down air. We still live here very close in percentage, but nice. Oh. He actually tried to time his uh, fair to hit the gyro, but he's a little bit too early. Let's see what, uh, what he can do with the stock lead here. He wasn't able to do much with it in the last game. Oh, my goodness. The water pushes the actually pushes the gyro off stage. I didn't realize that. There it is again. The water just pushes the gyro away every time. Oh, so close. Oh, my goodness. He's just barely avoiding the bell. Uh, Down nope, air. Still nope, not enough. Oh, my. The laser doesn't stop the uh, orange at all. Wow. T is edge guarding with these fruits like a master right here. We even saw him go for wow. orange a little bit early, but back air. That'll do it. Right, what's he gonna do with the Galaga? Oh my goodness, so much percent. You gotta watch it. Honestly, when when he has that Galaga at, at zero, you know he's going for something now, so you might as well just don't even give him the opportunity. Oh, great takes chase there the down smash. Why do you keep in this as close as he can? Oh man, going deep for the up air, way at the top of the screen, but oh my goodness, watch out for the belt. So close. Okay, Got up to the up air. Nope. Nice. Oh, wow. Going through the hydrant. Great stuff for Wadi. Sealing off that stock. See what he can do here, though. See, build on this lead. He's just been playing neutral really well. Playing around the projectiles of Pac-Man. Showing a lot of knowledge of how to deal with this character. Oh, wow. Not getting the F-Smash on the roll-in, surprisingly enough. Oh, okay. he missed the timing there with the downer. Get the right call too, especially with how much fuel Wadi's been using to try to come back on the stage. Oh, man, barely missing the jump call out with the up smash. Wadi just racking up all the free percent right now. Nice. Oh, he even hits with his own hydrant. Wadi going in right here. Still gonna live that Robert big boy. Oh. Man, these nares have just been hitting T so much. They really have. Oh, great tech. Staying alive here again. But there's the back throw. 91%. Not too bad for Wadi. Next big play will be the stock. And you can uh, move on to the next game. Mm -hmm. Oh. Missed the side B. Uh, T trying to keep the pressure at the ledge here. But Wadi just a little bit too tricky. Nice, Perry. Able to land here, but oh, oh too much time wow. with the ledge. Yeah, too much time with the ledge. I did not re realize I hit you at the ledge. Yeah, not only that, you do lose a uh, ledge invincibility a lot faster with more percent on you. Mm -hmm. Very great, great stuff for Wadi, evening up 1 1. Really, really good at keeping it close here with T with the Rob. Are we going for game three? Oh man, another game on PS2. This might be one of those all PS3 sets. Honestly, wouldn't be surprised if we see that. Wadi though, again off to a really strong start. Oh, nice down tilt with the gyro right there. <laughs> yeah. Down tilt in the gyro is so much percent. You get so many steps from that move. Again, these falling nares. Like, I don't know if T is just uh, getting mixed up for the timing of that, but he's just getting caught with that so much. Well, it helps a lot that uh, 
Rob's laser just goes through the, the, the hydrant too, so he's yeah. not able to just set up a wall with that move as much as he usually can. Let's go for the down throw it's again there. Yep, that'll uh, do it. The kill, not just but yet. again, great percent for Wadi. Just keeping him exactly where he wants him. There's the fair to hit the gyro away this time. Nice. Gets that forward air. T-Look and takes in a stage. And the oh, bell, but he narrowly misses it oh my goodness. on the chase. Why do you just like barely avoiding these bell setups? You can tell he wants to be nowhere near it, too, especially yeah. with such a lead oh. he has over T. One bell setup, and that will definitely turn things around. Right, Wadi, really close to getting this kill. Could probably go for the up throw on the platform to get this stock as well. All right, again, playing around the bell as patiently as possible. It's not going to give him any free setup right here. Oh, a little Back bit too lag on, no. too much lag on that. T at 171. If anything, Wadi's looking for any kind of grab or a possible aerial. Yeah, he's got to be careful here. T's mm -hmm. slowly bringing this game back. This first stock is very close for both players, but there's the up throw. Yep, that'll do it. Unsafe down smash. Yeah, why is this being uh, consistently getting the first stock in this set so far? Oh, tries to avoid the bell by rolling away, but just called out again with the force smash. Okay, another good setup here for T. What can you do with this hydrant here at the ledge? Oh my goodness, the Galaga again. Why is going high? Nice. Could have been really bad if you got caught by another Galaga set up there. Oh, man. Why do you know how to deal with this hydrant so well? Almost gets down there, too. T can't seem to catch a break here against Wadi's onslaught of projectiles, too. Yeah, again, just having so many ways to just pressure with his own projectiles while destroying the hydrant has been working out really well for Wadi. Yeah. Oh. Galaga, no, misses the mark here. T and Wadi at even percents. Oh. Oh, <laughs> oh the bell set up. He missed oh, the man. forward air. Yeah, I saw he was going for that Z drop into the water. That was been so good for him. If you get a, like, get a smash attack to connect there. Oh. Wadi, though, very close. Almost getting another back air while he's hanging on the ledge a little bit too long. Next one will definitely do it, especially since he can't hang on the ledge as uh, long as he wants to at this high percent. Okay. Has the bill. Can he make it work, though? Wadi's been blocking it pretty uh, consistently so far. Oh! oh. I, th I think Wadi actually wanted to reflect there, but he just ended up hitting T, so like it covered two options at once. Yeah. Down there? No, not yet. T does have stage control, but that laser managed to sneak its way. Fire hydrant down here, and he's trying to kick <laughs> Wadi as soon as he's trying to survive. Oh, man, Great what a deep edge guard. Yeah, seeing that he like, has very limited resources with that up B, he can only stay off stage for so long until he's just forced to, to you know, air dodge or be put in a bad spot. T recognizing that and just really edge guarding effectively. Nice oh. setup. T just chasing him down across the stage. Barry, can he get the up air? No, I like the goal for up till here. And T able to get the cross up behind Wadi. Charges fruit. I like it. Takes the time to go and charge for Bill because he knows how important that setup could be at this percent. Oh, I thought Wadi was going to take that bill for his own, but he's trying to keep him at the edge of the stage. Well, he oh, can, but oh he my goodness. The We're living just we barely. Just nice. Catching the gyro here. Oh. Down throw. Can nice. Nice awareness there for Wadi, but we're still living. Wow, I'm surprised. T holding on a dear life at 143% here. It saves the uppy. Able to recover. Oh. Can he mix up his timing? Gets the center stage now. T in a position to turn this game around. Oh. Now I would use the bell, but watch out for all these projectiles going everywhere. Down throw this time? No, they can go for the up throw. Oh, okay. yep. 
Nice. He tried his best to mash out as best he could, but a little bit difficult to do when you're at such a high percent. Almost brought that all the way back after living two really strong moves. But Wadi up 2-1 now. Very close to getting the run back on T. Yeah, it's, it's always a rough feel when you uh, send the guy to losers and then they beat you in the, the run back in the set that matters the most. Sometimes, yeah, and, and honestly, that's the question you have to ask because I'm like, did I really beat them today, yeah. right? <laughs> but Wadi, one game away from meeting Kameme in the losers finals. Back on Pokemon Stadium 2 yet again. He's trying to keep body pressure at the edge of the stage as best he can. Just really try to uh, do, his, do what he can to take the, the control of the game early on. Because so yeah. far, Wadi's just been able to secure the first stock and uh, been forcing T to fight from behind for pretty much the entirety of the game here. The parry and T right here at this point, 93% against Wadi. He's doing a pretty good job, honestly, just trying to charge uh, fruits and then find an opportunity to get a setup. Good solve from the Hydra. And Wadi calls it out with laser too. Well, he's been slowly catching up to how T has been installing himself at the ledge, too. Yeah, he hasn't been able to get those down airs just yet, but oh, oh that, oh, that, no, that, that was a play, but he missed it. Yeah. T very close to getting this first stock, though. Why are you going to have to make a little bit of a comeback here? Oh, it's going to do the gyro. Oh, nice catching the roll. Not going to be enough to kill, but really good awareness there for Wadi. I like it. Wadi just kind of set himself oh. up there in the sky to meet up T. It kind of like scares you a little bit. He might he might be going for up air. Oh, so much pressure with the projectiles here from Wadi. T finds a way in, but there's the belt. What's he going to do? No, again, Wadi playing around the belt very intelligently. Yeah. Goes for such a high rate. Oh, did to you come catch back it? Around. Yeah. yeah. Wow, his landing was so tricky there. T just couldn't find an opening and uh, dropped the first stock again to Wadi. All right. I like it. Save the gyro there to actually clank with the bell and then see what it can do for it. Because he knows how much bell means, at the, especially at the ledge. Yep. It covers neutral get up. Mm -hmm. It's like similar to like a zero suit down smash. If zero suit down smash were a projectile that bounced. Oh. Oh. oh that, yeah. Untackable. Yeah, untackable. Yeah, the untackable there. Nice. And Wadi just doing a really good job of avoiding these projectile setups. It's really difficult for T to get as many of his combos off as he usually does. And uh, that's just a testament of Wadi's patience. Oh. Okay, opportunity here. Oh. Wadi has enough fuel here to make it back on stage. Nice. He knows. He knows how that crap works. Could it be down there or reading the new, like the jump cannon from Pac-Man. Really close here. All these guys fighting back and forth. Oh, what? The heck? I thought he was gonna get like something off the water there. That looked really interesting. Oh. Uh, yep. I like that. He's been so good on punishing dash attack against T. Oh, no spike hitbox though. Don't and, smash. Oh yep, man. Do it. So much pressure at the ledge from Wadi. just made it so difficult to get away with anything there. Yeah, Wadi one stuck away from getting this game over uh, oh. Oh, no. over T. Not able to get much off of that stun from the bell. Wadi just getting all the percent he can here. Nice. Another combo there. Just racking up all this free damage. Really building on his lead so well. Not able to get the throw, but Wadi calling out the roll. Man, he's applying so much pressure right now. Robbie's going in so aggressive. Keeping T on the defensive here, just, man, it's really hard for him to press any of his fruits because he's just getting swatted before he can do anything. Yeah. Oh. Laser. So close to death here. Good Wadi just for... one big read away. Wadi knows, too, down there at that point where T is making the trampoline recovery. He might oh, be going for back up, but he jump, reads the, and that's the jump. It. <laughs> and Wadi T. will take it over T. T just kind of freezes up there. He's like, well, that happened. T is eliminated by Wadi in the run back.